Hello there, Psyduck from Venus Lair here. And yeah, today I just figured I would like to update the Gen and Tutorial videos for Pokemon Scarlet and Violet. Now, the first thing you want to do if you join in the Discord is scroll to this channel called Self Rolls and Verification. And yeah, once you're here, I literally just want you to react to the message inside it. Read the message first, and then react using the bubble cell roll. Once you do this, this should unlock the entire Discord for you. Right, do this first, and then you'll be ready to go. Right, next step, I want you to locate one of the free Scarlet and Violet Gen bots. For the purpose of this video, we'll be using Tinker Tom bot here. There's also another free Scarlet and Violet Gen bot, Corviknight bot, but yeah. We'll just use Tinkerton today. Uh, right, once you've done that, I want you to go to Google or any browser and type in Pokemon Showdown. And once you're here, I want you to type, uh, select this thing called Team Builder. Right, select this, and then once you've done that, select a new team. Now, first thing you want to do is make sure your format's right. Go to Scarlet and Violet Format. Best I pick is anything goes. This, yeah, this gives you the option to create anything. For the purpose of this video today, we'll just create a Brawler. Now from this section here, I've actually slowed down the video a lot, but it's not really hard to create a Pokemon from Pokemon Showdown Team Builder, but I'm going to go through as slow as possible and step by step. Right, okay, the first thing you want to do is you want to go to where it says details, and from here you can actually select the Pokemon's gender if you want it male or female, I'll leave that random, or you can select if it's shiny or non-shiny, or if you're creating a Pokemon from Pokemon Scarlet and Violet, you can, yeah, you can... Choose whatever teratype you want it to be. I think for this Rowlet, I actually went for flying. I'm not really sure what the what is the best teratype for Rowlet, but I think flying works. Like it looks like a bird. Well, it, I mean, it is an owl. <laughs> but yeah, once once you've done that, once you've selected your teratype, you can now select whatever level you want the Pokemon to be. I think for this Rowlet, yeah, I just made it level 35. I don't know why. Uh, maybe because it's easy to evolve from there. <laughs> but yeah. You can now select whatever item you want the Pokemon to hold. To do this, just write out whatever item you want, or you can pick from the most popular. Right, after you've done that, you can select whatever ability you want the Pokemon to have. All the Pokemon's natural abilities will already be here, so you can just pick from whatever you want. I picked Long Reach for a Rowlet, which is its hidden ability. And yeah, from this point here, you can select whatever moves that you want the Pokemon to have. If you've already, if you've already got all your moves in your head, you can simply write them out. Or, as you can see, it will nicely show you all moves that this Pokemon can learn. I think I just, yeah, I just went with cool moves for this roll-up. Uh, moves that I thought were cool. But yeah, anyways, um, apologies if you can hear any noises in the background of this video today. Um, using my phone to record, and it's, yeah, the microphone's not the greatest. <laughs> but if I can, I'm going to put some music over this, so hopefully it doesn't hear that, it doesn't sound that bad, and you can't hear seagulls and trucks and stuff like that, but, yeah. I'm gonna speed up this section anyway because I think yeah I yeah, I took a little bit uh, took a little bit of time to select my moves so yeah I'm gonna speed up a bit. Right from this point here you can edit in the Pokemon stats or reviews. To do this, just simply select where it says stats and you can change the Pokemon's nature and edit in its EV spread. To do that, just simply move up the EV button and yeah you're good to go. I think at this point here this Rowlet is actually ready to gen so. Moving on to the next point, you, uh, where it says import slash export, I want you to select this and this will give you this line of text here, just simply copy this and yeah, you're good to go man, this Rowlet is ready to jam. Now this next point here is totally optional, like I said, that Rowlet is good to go. If you don't care about your training information, yeah, you can jam that Rowlet as is, but if you do, if you want your own training information attached to this Pokemon, find yourself a notepad app or anywhere to place your text and copy this video here, uh, this will show you how to put your own OT, your TIT, your, um, your your SID and such if you know that, and yeah, just follow the video man and you'll be good to go. One more note before moving on, because Showdown doesn't actually give you the option for this, but if you care about specific ball types, just simply add this line in here as well. Uh, like, yeah, for example, I give this Rowlet a Beast Bomb, but I'd also like to note as well, if you leave this line completely out, the bot will naturally, yeah, the Tinker Dom bot will naturally give you a uh, matching ball color for whatever Pokemon you gen for it. But this, yeah, moving on to the next part, this is ready to go now. 
Right, at this point now, it's just about reselecting the whole text and copying. Once we've done that, let's head back to the Discord and locate Tinker Tomba. First thing you want to text out is I, uh, exclamation point trade. Then paste that text we've just created, or the text I've just created rather. And Tinker Tomba should place me in a queue. Wait, and she'll, yeah, she'll message me with a link code. I'm gonna go and grab my switch and trade for this roll that I've just made. And there we go, this route looks perfect. It has all the information that I've specified. It's as easy as that. If you want to create any Pokemon you want from Pokemon Scarlet and Violet, simply follow the methods of this video today and hit up my Discord. Currently now I'm hosting a four Scarlet and Violet Denim bots along with DDSP bots, Pokemon Legends Arceus bots and Pokemon Sword and Shield bots. That's all folks, I hope this video helps you out today. Have a good one and much love to you.